Grace and my name is Love. Today we are going to read the Bible story. 14th chapter, Jesus the Son of God. Jesus took his disciple to a high mountain. He went up with Peter, <laughs> Jake, and the, the brother <laughs> of The disciples talked to one another. Why are we here? I don't know. <clears throat> Jesus must know. When Jesus' face began to shine, Jesus' clothes began to shine. The disciples uh, were very afraid. Yeah, I'm done. Then Moses and Elijah appeared and talked with Jesus. Peter said to Jesus, Lord, I like get here. I want to set up three tents there. One for Jesus, one for Moses, <laughs> and one for Elijah. <laughs> so I was... Mm, I was... <laughs> mm, touching the slime. It was my but <laughs> Are you okay? Love. Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> and Peter was saying this, suddenly a shining cloud covered them. This is my son who I love. <gasps> Listen to me. God said in the cloud. <laughs> the disciples were terrified. They fell face down to the ground. When they stood up, there was no one except Jesus. God told us, you are the Son of God, said the disciples. Now the disciples got to know that the Jesus was the son of God. Oh. Yeah. Fifteen chapter I greet rich. Chapter fifteen. <laughs> A greedy rich man. There was a rich man. He had a big farm. He had a big storehouse. He had a good house. He had a good house. He had a lot of money. He had a lot of money. He really had many good things. Good things. <laughs> The rich man didn't know what to do with all those things. Dang. I have to build more storehouses. Storehouse! Said the man. Yeah. Said the man. I am going to make bigger storehouses. I am going to make bigger storehouses. Go on. Go on. The rich man loved the things he had. The rich man loved, he loved the things, these things he had. more than he loved God. Loved God. The rich man didn't thank God for the things he had. Yeah. <laughs> he didn't share them with his neighbors. Yeah. He said, I will enjoy all the things I have. Ooh. <laughs> I won't give anything to others. <laughs> they are all I need them all. No. You will die tonight. Die. Die. Said God. God. If you die tonight, others will take everything you have. Everything you have. She got cooked. 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 Didn't even believe it. Eat. Believe it. Eat. Eat. Ah! Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> no! 
Oh. You hate it. Believe it. Believe it. He died that night after all. Then other people came to and took everything. What the rich man had. Uh, my actually love was saying. Oh, end of the story. The rat will come and eat them. No, 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 no. <laughs> eat them. No, no. <laughs> she was saying like this. Fast. Okay, I will not do what you. God gave everything to us. We have us to share all our things with our friend. Ow, ow, <laughs> Chapter 16. A good shepherd finds a lost sheep. One day, Jesus told the disciples about a good shepherd. It was a story about a lost sheep. The sheep left its friend and was lost. It couldn't. It couldn't find a way home. It couldn't find its shepherd. The sheep was scared. Scared. <laughs> In the evening, the shepherd had to go back home with his sheep. He had to protect his sheep from lions and bears. He counted them to make sure they're all there. One, two, three, ninety-nine. That's very strange. I need a hundred. The shepherd counted several times. He found out that one sheep was missing. 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 The good shepherd left his sheep. He left all the sheep behind and went out to look for the lost sheep. <laughs> he was she was saying she why doesn't shepherd has so, like, if he go and find only one sheep, the 99 sheep will be lost, maybe, because he leave them there alone. So why don't he take them all together? Because then it will be like, he's only finding one sheep and losing 99 sheep. That's so lame. I think. The shepherd looked everywhere for the sheep. At last, he found the lost sheep. He hacked the sheep and carried it back home. Your turn. I think... He have left to his friend to take care, and also, or when we, he will carry all sheep. They can also, again, they can be lost. But the young chickens are not Okay, just. Sometimes we forgot about God. Jesus comes to us to let us find God. Jesus is the only way to go. The kingdom of God. Chapter 17. Children meet Jesus. We want Jesus to bless our children. Let us meet Jesus. Mother and mothers and fathers brought their children to Jesus. No, said Jesus' disciple. Why not? Asked the parents. They really wanted Jesus to bless their children. Jesus is. Jesus has so many things to do. Don't push him, said the disciple. But Jesus loves everyone equally. Yeah. Jesus came to them then. What's going on here? Asked Jesus. Your disciples don't allow our children to go near you, said the parents. Jesus' disciples said, We told them not to come near you because you are so busy. Don't 
keep them away from me, said Jesus to the disciple. Let the children come to me. Let the children come to me. You must become like these little children if you wanted to enter God's kingdom. I think Jesus, okay. Jesus allowed the children to come to him. He told them many stories. He told them about God. He told them about the house of God in heaven. He told them how much God loves them. I think, yeah, I think mm, we should be like children because they don't like when somebody on somebody's t-shirt, there was his name. And when he, when he was saying, he was going and when, when, when people came, it was a big person and he have, she have called her name and said, and said to them, uh, thank you for remembering my all. Name and he said, Oh, yeah, uh, she said, You're my friend. How can I? Ah, forgot. And one time, and he said, He also called her name and he said, Thank you for telling and remembering my name. And um, he was saying on your t-shirt, there is your name. So I have called you. Uh, one, time, one time, I, um, somebody told me, like, children are not saying like, Oh, we have more. People said that. People said that Jesus was too busy to meet the children, but Jesus put the children on his knees and told them stories. The kingdom of God was. Lesson the to the children. If uh, if you want to go to the kingdom of God, hmm? where are you? Like these children, you have to believe in God and come to Him with clean hearts. He also said, "Children must. Children must. Most important in the kingdom of God." Yeah. Chapter 18. Jesus. Chapter 18. Jesus healed the blind beggar. That the story I will read next time. Yeah, and maybe also tomorrow I will read two four stories. Yeah. Bye. Then bye.